Hello everyone and thank you for watching. Today we're going to speak about Operation Aisha. The Gran Sasso Raid refers to Operation Aisha, the rescue of Italian dictator Benito Mussolini by German paratroopers led by Major Otto Harold Morse and Waffen SS Commandos in September of 1943 during World War II. The airborne operation was personally ordered by Adolf Hitler, planned by Major Harold Morse, and approved by General Kurt Student. During the night between July 24th and 25th of 1943, just a few weeks after the Allied invasion of Sicily and the bombing of Rome, the Italian Grand Council of Fascism voted a motion of no confidence against Mussolini, and on that same day the king would have him replaced and then arrested. Mussolini would be transported around Italy by his captors, while Otto Scorzani, selected personally by Hitler and Ernst Kaltenbrunner to carry out the mission, was tracking him. Intercepting a coded Italian radio message, Scorzani used the reconnaissance provided by agents and informants of SS to determine that Mussolini was being imprisoned at a nearby ski resort in Italy's Gran Sasso, high within the Apennine Mountains. Then on the 12th of September 1943, Scorzani and his team would initiate a rescue mission to get Mussolini in a high-risk glider. The commandos would land their DFS-230 gliders on the mountain, with only one crashing, causing some minor injuries to its passengers. The team and Scorzini's special troopers then overwhelmed Mussolini's captors, 200 well-equipped guards, without a single shot being fired, mainly because they were ordered to either stand down or be executed for treason. Scorzani then attacked the radio operator and his equipment and formally greeted Mussolini with Duce, the Führer has sent me to set you free. To which Mussolini then replied, I knew that my friend would not forsake me. Mussolini would then be liberated from the ski resort and flown by aircraft to a nearby military airport where he stayed overnight at the Hotel Imperial and would be given a hero's welcome. The operation on the ground at the ski resort would be led by Major Otto Harold Morse under the orders of General Kurt Student, but Scorzani would steward the Italian leader first into Rome and then eventually into Berlin right in front of cameras. After a pro-SS propaganda coup at the behest of Heinrich Himmler and propaganda minister Joseph Goebbels, Scorzani and his special forces of the Waffen-SS were granted the majority of the credit for the operation. This operation would grant a rare late war public relations opportunity to the Germans, and Mussolini would be made leader of the Italian Social Republic. Otto Scorzani gained a large amount of success from the mission, receiving a promotion and the award of the Knight's Cross of the Iron Cross, along with fame that would lead to his most dangerous man in Europe image. Even Winston Churchill himself would describe the mission as one of great daring. What do you think of this mission to rescue Mussolini? Was it actually legitimate? Or was it set up by the Germans in conjunction with those who captured him? Let me know about it in the comments below. Also be sure to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time.